If you like this video, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell icon to get the latest updates. Welcome to Zarin Tech this module on launching integrations from the Workday tenant. In this module, we will learn how to launch an integration that has been deployed to the tenant from within the Workday interface. Disclaimer, this video, including examples, images, and references are provided for informational purposes only. Complying with all applicable copyright laws is the responsibility of the user. Without limiting the rights under copyright, no part of this document may be reproduced, stored or introduced into a retrieval system, or transmitted in any form or by any means. Credits shall be given to the images taken from open source and cannot be used for promotional activities. In this module we will cover how to launch integrations from the tenant. Once the integration system is deployed, you can also launch it from the tenant. By navigating to the integration system in the tenant, you may use the related actions menu to launch or schedule the integration system. Please note that you may see all launches of Workday Studio integrations, regardless of where they were initiated in the integration events report on the tenant. This is in contrast to the process monitor on the Workday Studio client which will only report the launches started within the Workday Studio client. Thank you for watching this module on launching integrations from the Workday tenant. Be sure to subscribe to our channel for more informative videos on Workday Studio. Thank you for attending the session. I hope you all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Also feel free to ask your questions in the comment section below and we will reply to them at the earliest.